So we just had barbarian hunting of a large scale with level 26 to 30 barbs and I want to join another one um, but I have 39 minutes of uh, healing time and he's scheduling it for about 20 minutes. So I'm going to do this in batches hoping that I have enough people online to help speed this up. I'll set up this first one for 13 minutes, ask for some help, see who responds to giving me some help. It's already gotten down to 10 minutes, so they've already cut down three of the minutes. So we'll see. I'm not going to pay attention to this very closely, but that is a way of speeding up your um, healing. Went down another three minutes right there with just people pressing the spam help. So you can do it in increments like that, and it's especially good if you have increments of less than an hour that you're doing because you get a minute off for every person who presses the help button and for me it's up to 24 minutes that I can get help for but I don't think that we're that active and I want to get as many healed as possible but look at that it already took it down to 30 seconds so I'll be able to set up another one I'll probably do another 13 minute one that one worked out really well um, I want to heal my T4 ones first because they are bigger better fighters so I am putting my level 3's to the end because I don't have a lot of T4 troops. If you look at my troop setup, I only have, um, well it's not including what's in the hospital, but I believe I have about 30,000 of T4, maybe 35,000. It's hard for me to know because there's a lot in the hospital and this is units and that's not. So let's see. After this healing, oh, I already got down to less than seven minutes, so I got immediately six quick heals, six minutes of quick heals. So that is a very good way of speeding up your healing. And for those of us that are in Kingdom versus Kingdom and KVK, and some people are on the battlefields, there is like as much as, look at that, already down to less than a minute. There is like uh, upwards of over 24 hours of healing time and sometimes there's going to be wars sooner than that so you want to be able to make sure you can get your troops as healthy as possible as quickly as possible so if you are online do it in small increments like that take advantage of the help that your alliance can offer you now I'm down to 14 and a half minutes I'll just go ahead and just finish off these real quick and then do the t3 because I have plenty of t3 I have to send this troop home anyways because he's got more that need to go be healed so, well actually no, because only the severely healed go to the hospital. And so now we'll do this 11 minute one. So I'm almost completely healed. That only took less than, what, three minutes? And uh, it was scheduled for 40 minutes, less up to 24 minutes of Alliance help. So it was up scheduled for more than 16 minutes and it took less than three. So that is a great way for speeding up your healing. Do it in small batches. And you can also, as you know, when you're doing your healing, unfortunately I can't show it right now, you can choose to heal your infantry or your cavalry or your archers. You know, you can choose what type you want to be healing. In this case, I wanted to heal my T4, so I put them ahead of the others. But you can also do it with um, a specific type of troop as well. So that way you decide just how quickly you will heal based on how active you're willing to play around with feeding or determining how many troops to be healed in any given time frame. Okay, for now, I'm wishing you Godspeed and signing off.